What's going on everybody? Welcome to the vlog. Today we're doing some work on an old truck. Uh, upper and lower ball joints. The hub assembly. Because uh, you guys can spot the problem. You can, uh, you know, tell your buddies and be like, Oh, this dude's only running four studs on his Duramax, bro. Yeah, I am. And uh, I'm going to be fixing that today. So uh, we're going to take it off. We'll show you how bad it is. Yeah, and then maybe once it's done, we'll take her for a rip. I also chopped up the exhaust today, which uh, I don't know how I feel about that, but it sounds pretty nasty. It sounds like a 6.0, it's so raspy. But uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, I'm gonna try and do this more regu regularly. But yeah, we'll get going on this and I'll check back in to you in a minute. Well, Kyle. Is it, uh, is it a little stuck, hey? Uh, a little stuck. Yeah, it's pretty stuck. So. So, I uh, did the Walmart special. Got me some uh, black leaf springs, hey? It's uh, looking pretty Walmart special to me. <laughs> but, I don't know, sometimes it's the little things that can make something pop um if you want some drag slicks let me know 275 55 r20 right there bridgestone they work great uh the fronts i mean all my four-wheel drive boosted launches are just crazy i i just can't do a burnout though i mean these things are nasty let me all right let me tell you a story so with the with my four-wheel drive neuromax i uh you know start building boost like I'm at the light, maybe like 20 pounds of boost. That's that's easing into the throttle. And I just give her hell. I'm hitting about 80 pounds of boost and then she's gone, just smoking all the tires. But it's weird, only the back tires spin. Front tires are you know, just just fine. But uh, yeah, I'm just I'm messing with you guys unless you, you're, you're slow. Okay, um, well, we have some damage on the old uh, right front. It got a little windy and it blew my tire over. I'm uh, pretty sad. Pretty sad. Um, we got the old Duramax problem. Good old coolant. Uh, it needs a water pump. I might get one from Sinister Diesel. Uh, if you want to use Cummins Gal 10 for 10% off your order, go ahead, 10% off. Uh, I think it's like a hundred and no, two hundred and seven bucks for a water pump for my truck with the welded nut on the front. So I think I might get it. I don't know. Well, I mean, I need a water pump, obviously, but truck's coming along good. Kyle's uh, being lazy as always. Um, but yeah, we will get back to you when the truck is finally finished. I uh, like usual. I always forget to end the video. It's like maybe a week later. Actually, yeah, a week later. Uh, I was supposed to do the uh, what was it? left front today. It ended up raining. I didn't really feel like working on it, so I just washed it after it rained. But it's supposed to rain tomorrow, so I might do it tomorrow, might not. But it's looking definitely tread wear is not wearing as much, which is good. That means... uh my hub was pretty, well not my hub, sorry, my uh, ball joints were pretty, pretty out of whack. But, only thing I do is the left front, upper and lower ball joints and tie rod, take maybe an hour, then it'll be done. But, yeah, I rented the whole video, edited it, edited it, I didn't edit it, I just kind of threw some clips together, together, and I thought I finished it. No, I didn't finish it. But she's looking pretty mint. I think I'm done going to the strip this year. I'll uh I'll go back next year. Be even faster. I got I got some goodies planned for the old truck. I'm not telling anybody what it is. They'll just have to wait and see. But I'm really liking the axle dump. It really echoes a lot more and sounds more raspy. But uh, the only thing I don't like is my uh, 
gets soot all over the back bumper and the trailer. But it's nice when people are, well, it's not nice, but when people are behind you and they're telling you, you can just romp on it and they'll back up. Cause, oh my God, a dirt macker. It's a diesel, it's rolling coal on me. with that black stuff? Oh my God, let's call the cops. Go ahead, call the cops. I ain't got plates. The plate that you saw, it's, it's not registered to the truck. So what are you gonna do? Actually, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna take that off. That'd be the smart idea because they, they could still call and be like, well, here's the plate license plate. They could probably still track down my address. Or, you know, I could just get it registered and put some insurance on it. That would that'd honestly be the smart thing to do, but uh, kind of broke. So, yeah. Yeah, I went to Janesville the other night. I got three more tickets on top of the four I got last weekend, which is really smart. So, uh, but hey, I won. And that's all that matters. Dude was butthurt. I'm not wasting my time with you, Duramax. Shut the fuck up, kid. But yeah, that'll be it for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. New video should be up sometime next weekend. And, uh, I will see you guys in the next one. And that sounded really gay. Oh, well. I'll see you guys in the next one.